have a slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this, I'll show up I don't ever slow up, no I don't take shit, I got no love for the fakeness CBS The Bold and the Beautiful Spoils revealed that Sheila is looking too quickly to be able to execute her revenge plan. But if Sheila leaves the house in disguise, it will soon be discovered. So all this time she's been staying in Deacon's house so as not to be detected. Sheila couldn't bear the situation forever. Sheila made a decision that she was going to have plastic surgery. That way no one will be able to recognize her anymore. But is this decision secret? Sheila has money to go for plastic surgery. Deacon just got out of prison and doesn't have the money for Sheila to use for this. Maybe Sheila will steal to get money for Sheila to use for this. And maybe Sheila will steal to get the large amount of money. Sheila will probably do this surgery and now there is no better way than facial surgery. But before Sheila has surgery, will someone find out she's still alive? How will Finn and Steffi's family be in danger while Sheila's still alive? And what will happen? Meanwhile, Quinn and Carter really ended up coming together, despite everything. This comeback really happened so fast. Everyone couldn't believe they broke up. Quinn chose to divorce Eric to Carter, and Carter also broke off his engagement with Paris to come to Quinn. The two of them defied so to come together that ended too quickly. They often had arguments and disagreements that could not be resolved, but Carter didn't want to break up with her because of that. But Quinn's sudden departure brought the love story to an end, and Carter suffered for a long time because of this. Grace had heard about this through someone else, and she was overjoyed that Carter and Quinn had broken up. Grace felt that it was a result of the couple deserved for hurting her daughter, and Carter was too callous to abandon Paris at the wedding. Nothing can be more heartbreaking than when Carter did this result. It's too worthy for a selfish person like Carter and Quinn. Besides, the relationship between Ridge and Brooke has turned bad. There's a high possibility that they will divorce in the near future. Since Taylor appeared, the two of them started to have problems and were no longer the same. Taylor still loves Ridge and always wants to come back with him. Steffi's very supportive of this because she always wants her family to be able to reunite and have a happy family. Ridge loves his son very much, so he's very confused as to what to do. We've seen the ceremony to renew the vows of husband and wife Ridge and Brooke was coming, but Ridge refused to hold the ceremony. And much to Brooke's disappointment, Brooke at first forbade Ridge and Taylor from contacting each other for fear of their relationship would go wrong. Yet this day finally arrived much quicker than Brooke thought. How will Ridge ultimately decide? Are you going to divorce Brooke? and go back to Taylor and her daughter? Or does Ridge still have the courage to go not go astray? Brooke didn't do anything wrong anyways. Was Ridge doing too much for her? How will things turn out?